Hello and welcome to the Nortel Post Sales Technical Podcast for the new suite of SMB data solutions. My name is Mick Henderson of Land Systems, Nortel's premier wholesale distributor in Australia, and joining me today is the Land Systems pre-sales engineer for Nortel, Paul Buckingham. Hi, I'm Paul Buckingham, and this is an introduction to the installation and initial programming of the new business Ethernet switch family from Nortel. The BES 50 range comes in two options, 10, 100 and gigabit Ethernet versions. They come with either 12 or 24 ports, and all of them have 12 ports providing power over Ethernet for devices such as IP phones, IP cameras and the like. For this demonstration, I'm going to run through the basic implementation of the BES 50 24 port switch. All principles outlined here apply to the whole range of the BES 50 family. The management tool for the complete range of SMB products is Business Element Manager, available as a download from Nortel's support site, and I'm going to be using Element Manager to access the BES 50. First though, you'll need to mount the switch. Each of the SMB products comes with a quick install guide. Now we'll go through the steps required to set up a BS50. Before you start, you'll need to plan your network. You'll need to know what your IP address range is. You'll need to know what virtual LANs or VLANs you're going to be defining and what ports you're going to assign to each of those VLANs. For this demonstration, I'm going to use the BS default IP address. I'll define two VLANs and I'll assign a number of ports to each of those VLANs. Connect your PC to a port on the switch. You may need to change your PC network settings to the same range as the BES. I've used 192.168.1.50. While the switch is booting up, the status LED will flash and will change to solid green when the start procedure is complete. From the main menu, choose Administration, Quick Start. The Quick Start screen appears showing IP address and the few other items that can be manually configured. While we're in the web page, I recommend that you change the system password. Select Administration, Security, User Accounts and go to the Change Password field. Enter NN Admin and change the password. Click Change Password. I'll now step through some of the common switch parameters. The first task we will perform will be to define our two VLANs, VLAN 2 and 3. Click on Applications, VLAN, 802.1Q VLAN, Static List. Go to the new field and enter VLAN ID, 2 in our example, and the VLAN name, VLAN 2, and check Enable. Click Add. Repeat this for VLAN 3. Now we'll assign ports to these new VLANs. Click on Applications, VLAN, 802.1Q VLAN, Static Table. Go to the VLAN drop-down box and select the VLAN you want to assign ports to. Then go to the Port Table Select the ports and tagging options. Click Submit. So that's an overview of how to set up a business Ethernet Switch 50. Now that wasn't hard, was it? By delivering one or all of the Nortel SMB solutions to your clients, you will not only add them to the 15 million plus users globally relying on Nortel SMB solutions to empower their business, but you'll also be delivering a single vendor turnkey solution encompassing connectivity, convergence, mobility and security. So if you're searching for a small solution with big features to grow your business, Welcome to Nortel SMB.